Coaching has been one of the loves of my life. And I remember when I first started coaching, when you cut your teeth as a coach, there are certain ways that you should go about doing it and certain pitfalls that I hope to help new coaches along that path. Great interpersonal skills are important, but the first one I want to go over is called chunking. Chunking is digestible skills because certain people will come into your academy with preset skill sets, meaning some people will take to it like a duck to water, while other people, you just can't quite get their body to move on certain techniques the way that you'd like. We've all experienced it. Some of the simple stuff I've had a hard time with, some of the more advanced stuff, so quick. So it really just depends upon the student. But as a coach, I remember when I first started coaching, I wanted perfection out of the gates. And this can be very disheartening for certain students. So what I would suggest is, when you're working with students, make one correction, just one correction. Let them work on it. And when you see that they've made that correction, then add the next one. Because they could have 10 things wrong with their, with their overhand right. They could. They could have a lot wrong with it. Give them one thing. And then when they get it, give them the next thing. This is chunking of information. Of course, you're going to want them to, to have perfection immediately. We all want that for, for our students, but sometimes that's just not practical. So what a better method would be chunking. Chunking helps to keep them stay motivated. It keeps them positive. They go home feeling like they've accomplished something and they want to come back. Because if you anchor too much negativity to it that they feel they can't quite get the technique, they're not going to want to come back and continue. And at the end of the day, it's about how they feel when they leave the studio or the academy.